my name is Naomi. It is good to see you join us here at Mosaic Kids Online. I hope you had the very best week. So let's jump on our feet and celebrate who our God is. This song is called Belong. Do you know that he's always with us? We get to belong to him and be a part of his family. How awesome is that? Let's celebrate. Guys, you've come right at the good time. I needed a break. So I'm trying to learn new hobbies and I'm trying to grow my strengths, but it's just not working. Hmm. I know, the Bible's meant to give us the wisdom, right? So it might, just might, help me. Aha! In Philippians 4, verse 13, it says... I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. So he gives me strength. Can you think of ways that you could ask for God's help? 
Maybe you were worried or a bit afraid, or maybe you need help with something really hard. Or maybe you need help lifting something very heavy like me. Or maybe you need help with somebody else who is having a hard time. Even if I really don't believe that I can do something, our God says you can do anything through him. Why? Because he gives us the strength. There's a little boy in the Bible called David and he was destined to become the greatest king that his country has ever known. But at that time he was just a little shepherd, unknown to anybody. But he trusted God and asked God to give him the strength to battle the enemies of the nation. Which meant he would have to battle a great big giant who was more than twice his size. Can you imagine that? But God gave him the strength to go face to face with the giant. And he brought the giant down with a single pebble and a sling, which he found in the book. He said in the Bible, you come against me with swords and spears, but I come against you with the name of the Lord Almighty. The Lord will hand you over to me. David also said in the Bible that the Lord is the strength of my life. Of whom then shall I be afraid? Guys, I believe that if we pray to our God and thank him and ask him for wisdom, maybe in this time you're a little bit worried and afraid about it all, you should pray and ask for God's peace. Lord Jesus, I just thank you that no matter what, you are always here. That no matter what, we are never alone. I pray that during this time, although it might be scary and we might be afraid, that you show yourself to us. That you are here with us. That you are right next to us, Lord Jesus. I pray that today and tomorrow, that we have a great feeling of you next to us. In Jesus' name, Amen. News. I am your host, Bruce News, and this is my sidekick, Rick. I like Nerf Wars. Thanks, Rick. Coming up in this week's news, we check out what's happening in our brilliant city. We conduct a science experiment, found interesting, and see who delivers joke of the week. Evan's mommy and daddy are working hard on putting smiles on people's faces by singing with lots of people. Thank you, Evans, Mummy and Daddy. Now for an experiment. Thanks, Bruce. So this is an easy experiment. You need a, a cup, a card, and a tap with running water. Should we show them how to do it then? Yeah. Right, so what's the first thing we need to do? We need to fill the cup with water. Yeah. All the way to the top. All the way to the top. And then what? Place the card on the top. top. And then turn it around. And what does that do? And then it creates a suction so the card doesn't fall off. Wow, look at that. And does it work? Could I hold that over your head? Yeah. Wow, that does work. Gosh, I could hold that there all day. What do you call cheese that's not yours? Nacho cheese! <laughs> Thanks Anna, that was week, this week's news. Goodbye from Bruce. Goodbye from Rick. Okay guys, don't forget to learn that memory verse. Have a go at the craft and send us those photos. We would love to see them. I hope you had a great time with us here at Mosaic Kids Online. Make sure you join us next week. We will be here, same time, 12pm. We have got so much fun coming up, so see you soon.